internet. We're about to walk up to Devil's Punch Bowl, which is a nice little walk at Arthur's Pass. It's only about an hour there and back. So, just enough to wear off our lunch. If you're going to come to Arthur's Pass and do one walk, you do Devil's Punch Bowl because it's an easy walk. Just park the car, walk up the hill and back down again, and you've done a walk to a waterfall. Most of the other day walks in this area are more of the three to six hour variety, and a lot of them have peak in their names, which puts a lot of people off, including me. If you go off a little side track from the Devil's Punch Bowl track, you get here, which is the remains of an old power station. The power station was built when they were building the Otero Tunnel, which is a massive rail tunnel that takes the trains from up here at Arthur's Pass down to the west coast. And they needed power for their tunneling operation, so they built this power station. But as happens on the coast, the bush has reclaimed it very quickly. hear the waterfall quite a way before you get to it.
and then suddenly there's a waterfall through the trees. This is the Devil's Punch Bowl. It's a um, nice damp breeze on my back here after walking up that hill. Get a lot of mist off the waterfall. It's quite a walk up here, but very easy track. So worth the walk. <laughs> the actual punch bowl is the bottom of the falls. There's quite a deep pool there. You can't really get up there anymore. They've blocked off the tracks, so it's a bit too dangerous. Too many people falling on the rocks. 